Hello everyone and welcome to Puzzle. This is the working space of Jarvis LTD, uh, but today I'm here and I'll do my recap from here. Uh, so last week, as some of you might remember, I have uh, provided you with a trading plan regarding the Euro-Japanese yen currency pair. And uh, in this video, I would like to uh, see how the plan developed. I also provided you with two live signals based on that plan. Uh, both of the signals were posted in our new Telegram channel, so join it now from the link below this video. And uh, we'll talk about them, we'll talk about the current development of the plan, and we'll talk about some future predictions regarding this pair. Let's get started. First of all, what you see now on the screens is the plan itself posted on trading view i want to zoom a little bit so what was the idea here uh, the, uh, the pair reached this uh, huge uh, daily uh, resistance area it's actually a weekly resistance area and inside of it we have marked a daily area of consolidation we, if we go back, we can see where it comes from, but currently TradingView is not loading so far back, so you can check that on the trading plan video. Now, my um, expectations from here were for the price to bounce of this uh, daily area of consolidation and uh, form a new downtrend reaching to this daily support area, which uh, was also our target one zone. We had, uh, of course, a long-term target, this weekly support area, but this is for at least a few months of uh, downtrending. Now, here, as you can see, this red line uh, shows the previous stop the price made before a correction here. So, uh, just to be safe, it wasn't okay to enter between the, this daily uh, area of consolidation and this previous stop because it's risky and you have to use a huge stop loss in order to survive if uh, this uh, top is not broken. But if uh, we saw a break of this previous top, uh, you can uh, enter safer and uh, expect a down wave, at least to this blue line here, which was the top of wave one, and probably a continuation of the downtrend to the daily support area, which is our target one. Let's see what happened. As you can see, uh, today we are getting very, very close to the daily support uh, target. This is like around 20 pips left. Uh, this plan was posted here and it unfolded perfectly. Now I want to show you the two live signals I posted. They were both on the M5 time frame, and I want to say a few words about them. First of all, uh, here we had a small consolidation uh, period, after which we saw a, we saw a huge drop uh, in the price of the Euro Japanese yen, and after that there was a huge correction. Now here where uh, the price started to slow down. I posted my first entry in our Telegram channel uh, with the idea that this uh, previous consolidation will act as a resistance and uh, it won't be broken and a new wave down will reach at least to this uh, previous stop here. Uh, so, as you can see, the stop loss to that entry was uh, placed above this area and then after the price continued a little bit more up and entered into this uh, consolidation area or this square, uh, I decided to post the second entry right here at the top of it expecting uh, for the price to uh, stay <clears throat> inside this square and then uh, move further down again reaching at least to this previous bottom it made at 130.90. So the second entry was here and the stop loss was placed well above this red line which is um, H1 and M30 uh, resistance level. So my expectations were for the M5 to not break it. As you can see uh, the price went out of this box 
hit our stop loss of entry one, then stopped exactly here at this uh, resistance level. And from there, it just moved down, 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 down until here you can see it reached our take profit level. Overall, those two trades uh, gave around 23 pips of profit. Um, today, I have posted an yet another trade on the Euro Japanese Yen, which we won't discuss now. We'll discuss it in the next recap next week. But so far, it is giving us uh, some good profits. I, the, uh, the entry was posted both on Twitter and on uh, Telegram. Now, uh, I will switch to the H4 time frame just to make a few predictions about uh, this pair and what we can expect. Okay. So, uh, there is a high chance that we'll see a bounce somewhere either from the uh, daily support down here this green area or from this zone over here now this uh, zone will stop m30 uh, trends so here uh, i would expect a correction to at least maybe somewhere here and after that, probably a new wave down, reaching further and deeper inside of the daily support area, maybe even breaking it. So at this point, it's too uh, late uh, for an entry, but keep in mind this area here. And if the price retraces back to it, uh, I'll look for possible entries and I will post them on Twitter and in our Telegram channel. Again, there is a chance for the price to continue the down swing here uh, strongly, break this uh, level with this, and then I'll wait for the correction to inside of that daily support area to look for a new sell possibility and a further uh, movement down from the price of the Euro Japanese Yen. That's all for this recap. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you caught our signals. Uh, we made some good profits last week and so far we are on a very good profits for this week. Join the Telegram channel from the link below this video and I wish you a profitable end of the week.